President Biden is sending more anti-aircraft and drones to Ukraine to help the country fight against Russia. The president also announced an additional $800 million in military aid will be sent to Ukraine. This comes after Ukrainian President Zelensky made a plea to Congress today asking for more help in the war. During the speech, he again asked for a no-fly zone over Ukraine and called on more sanctions against Russian politicians. Senator Tim Kaine called Zerlinski heroic and agreed the U.S. must take more steps to condemn Russia's actions. We must, on behalf of Ukraine, continue our support, and it is important that Vladimir Putin's illegal effort to invade another country ultimately uh, run aground on the rocks of ruin, and it is important, and obviously we pray that that's sooner than later. Senator Kane is also pushing for Russian President Putin to be labeled a war criminal.